The car a Grand Prairie police officer was chasing when he died in a crash was first spotted because it had fake tags. The police chief says those same fake tags have been used on hundreds of cars all across the Metroplex. 32 year old officer Brandon Sy was killed when he lost control of his police car during that chase last night. Police are now looking for the other driver. The chief angry and frustrated as he described paper tag fraud as a widespread problem being exploited by violent criminals. Fox 4's Alex Boyer joins us with details. Alex. Heather and Steve, uh, Crime Stoppers is offering a $10,000 reward for information leading to the arrest of uh, the driver of that silver Chevy Malibu. Officer Sai just joined the Grand Prairie Police Department back in January of this year. Uh, the police chief says that the pursuit uh, spanned across about a five mile stretch of the city and he added that uh, Officer Sai dying, died rather, saving the community. The community is coming together outside the Grand Prairie Police Department to pay respects to fallen officer Brandon Sy. They need to be recognized. He's going to be missed, and he's up there with the good Lord now. Officer Sy, just 32 years old, died Monday night. According to the police chief, Sy was near the intersection of Beltline and Pioneer Parkway when he spotted a silver Chevy Malibu displaying a fake paper license plate. This same tag have been captured on over 200 different vehicles in the Dallas-Fort Worth area. Officer Sai attempted to stop the vehicle. The driver immediately fled. The police chief says Sai called for backup. A second Grand Prairie officer joined in the pursuit and ended up ahead of Sai. An officer Sai vehicle struck the rear of his backup officer's vehicle. This caused officer size vehicle to roll onto its side and into a traffic pole. The other officer was not injured. He had a passenger in the car who was also not hurt. The driver of the Chevy Malibu got away. We are asking for the public's help in identifying the driver of this vehicle. And as the investigation into the crash continues, a squad car parked outside police headquarters has turned into a memorial covered in flowers, balloons, and police badges from departments across North Texas. Among the mourners is Albert Castaneda Sr. His son, Grand Prairie Officer A.J. Castaneda, died in 2019 after being struck by a car while running radar. He says his heart hurts for Sai's family. I just came here to play, pay my respect to, uh, to the officer. He, he, he was a nice, real nice guy. I met him, and uh, I wish the family the well. And Officer Sai was an organ donor, so even in death, he is saving lives. Now, the police chief says that a candlelight vigil will be held here outside of the Grand Prairie Police Department on Friday at 6 p.m. The public is encouraged to attend as most of Officer Sai's family lives in Hong Kong. Back to you. All right, Alex Boyer, thanks.